Science. Kirsty Trigg suffers from schizophrenia, a neuropsychiatric disorder that affects about 1% of the global population. To date, the diagnosis of mental illness is highly subjective and mostly based on clinical interviews. This could now be backed by a new, low-cost blood test developed as part of a European research project. You know, you want to be like that. That's just too difficult. I was always um, fighting with my head, which was, was not doing the things I wanted it to do. It... Researchers at the Department of Chemical Engineering and Biotechnology at the University of Cambridge have been working on a blood test for schizophrenia for many years. Initial tests were too expensive, but they've now developed a new version which they claim is cheaper and provides much more detailed information. The test analyzes proteins in the patient's blood to distinguish between different kinds of mental illnesses. According to the researchers, with the new test, schizophrenia can be diagnosed with a certainty of 83% and depression with a certainty of about 90%. At the moment, um, the problem is with psychiatric disorders, we believe it's all in the mind and it's, it's something which is quite abstract. But if a patient can also see in the blood, you know, some abnormality, you can relate to it in, a, in the real world. For Kirsty, the test has made a big difference, allowing her to be clinically diagnosed with schizophrenia. Now that she has access to appropriate treatment, she says she's more in control of her everyday life. <laughs> 